Hey Earth Signs and welcome to my channel. I'm here doing your weekend love reading for the uh, 14th through the 16th, 2018. Um, I'm lumping them all together this time because tomorrow's my birthday, so I will not be around and I want to make sure you guys get a full reading to get you through the weekend. So um, this is going to be for Earth Signs singles, that's Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. So let's see what you guys have going on. Okay, your first card out, the Hermit. Your second card out was the Four of Cups in reverse. And your third card out, the Knight of Pentacles. The person you are dealing with. Who is your signs dealing with? The Nine of Cups in Reverse, the Two of Pentacles in Reverse, and the King of Swords. Nice energy for the weekend. What is their outcome? Okay. The Magician in Reverse, Justice. And seven of wands. Your guys' shared energy is strength in the reverse. Clarified by the world. And the seven of swords. Okay. So you are the person that you are dealing with. Whoever you're thinking of. Want to be in a relationship. Whatever the situation is. Somebody is lacking the courage. And letting fear overcome the situation. Of closing out a cycle in their life, moving on and moving forward. Um, and they're really cheating themselves out of um, a second chance, out of a who they're meant to be with. Um, yeah, they're lacking, they're lacking the courage to break free from whatever this energy is that um, is sneaky. And it's just, yeah. You could be um, waiting for somebody to leave somebody else, or you could be um, leaving a third party and going towards somebody else. Um, but whatever the situation is, this uh, cheating energy, this deceitful sneaking around is coming to an end. With the world card here, it's stopping. Um, whether you're leaving a third party or you are putting a third party or you are stopping a third party, um, yeah, you could be waiting for this person as well. But, uh, yeah. Um, Earth sign, you guys have been taking some time to yourself, taking some time to connect with your inner wisdom, um, reflecting off of what your life has been up to this point, where you want to go, who you want to be with. You've really taken some time to go within to um, some introspection on I'm not where I want to be, but where is it that I want to go? You know, like if you don't know where you're going, you don't know where you're going to end up. You're really taking the time to figure out that connecting with inner wisdom, your magic, all of it. Just you're really, really taking the time this time. You may have said you were before, but you really weren't. Now you are. In this time of reflection, you're going to see what it is that you've been missing this whole time. There was something right there in front of you. It's something that the universe was offering you, something that they were trying to show you. Whatever it is, you are now seeing it. And it's giving you the strength, the courage to move forward and offer something tangible to somebody. You are making moves this weekend, um, Earth sign. And it's and it's in a um, in a direction that you you really thought through, that you really, really want. And you're putting the end to um, cheating yourself out of the future that you deserve um, because of fear. You have been letting fear stand in your way of moving forward and, and going after what it is that you need, you want, and like I said, you deserve. The person you are dealing with, they have the Nine of Cups in reverse. So they could have been waiting for you for quite some time, um, and they just felt like this is over. Like they're not waiting any longer. They're no longer putting their head on a platter for you. You see the picture. 
they would have given you everything. They would have done anything for you, but they're pulling back their energy because you've been in this space and you haven't opened up communication with them. So they have no clue what you're up to. They think you just fell off the face of the earth and you're not wanting to speak with them. So they are tired of waiting. They are ending this um, nine of cups sitting and waiting for you. Um, <clears throat> they are finding balance in their life. They, uh, they could have been your third party or you could have been their third party, but there is no longer allowing this, uh, un, you know, like with everything up in the air, you never know what's going to happen. They're no longer, um, being a part of that energy. They're making decisions. They're cutting themselves out of this, uh, juggling act and they're moving forward. If you are the one that had the third party earth sign, they are cutting themselves away from the situation and no longer allowing themselves to be a part of the three ring circus. And they are finding balance, finding peace, making a conscious decision to move forward and no longer sit in this limbo of, well, I hope and I wish and I want. They are taking action and going after what it is that they want, what they need. And they're finding um, success in doing that. Your guys' outcome cards of the weekend are the Magician in Reverse. So there could have been um, some games being played here. Um, justice. So the, the, this comes right underneath the Four of Cups in Reverse for you, the Two of Pentacles in Reverse for them. And then there's Justice. So the Karmic Scales are balancing out. You deciding to put a stop to this energy of deceit, and moving forward and reflecting and doing what it is that you want. I do see you leaving, leaving a committed relationship, a long-term relationship, a marriage to go after your, the person you're meant to be with. You're ready to defend this connection. You're ready to take on whoever it is that, that tries to tear it down. And you're really going to fight for this person because this person, um, could have, you're moving to, you're moving towards this person with something tangible. They're already a king. You have to you have to up the ante. You have to come with your A game if you want this person to give you a chance. Because they've given you many chances before. So you're going to have to fight for this connection. You're going to have to bring it all. Go big or go home um, type of energy here. Because they, they just feel like there's been so much that they've been through. Yeah, they, they've already been battling with for you, with you, about you. Um, and they've had a lot of inner conflict about moving forward and moving on. So you're really going to have to step up your game, Earth Signs, if you are moving towards somebody. If somebody is coming towards you, uh, which I don't really see, then you're, you're going to have to. Because this person is guarded. They're, um, they're holding on tight to their emotions. They have this wall up. They're not wanting to invest in something that's a facade, that's something that isn't going to turn into something real, which they feel they have been a part of up to this point. One more. Okay, or three more. Wow. <laughs> Temperance, the Eight of Wands, and the Ten of Cups. So this person has had a lot of uh, conflict about... Um, giving their emotions back to you, allowing you in, allowing that wall to come down. Um, you're going to have to open up communication with them this weekend. You're going to have to express yourself. You're going to have to let them know how it is that you truly feel and how, what you truly want and to let them know it's real. And this is a twin flame soulmate relationship because Archangel's here to bless the connection. Um, this time is real. This time will give you balance, healing, the Ten of Cups, emotional contentment, um, and the the marrying of two souls into one as the twin flame um, connection does. So if you open up with this person and you express your feelings, tell them how you feel, this is what the outcome will be. The karmic scales will be balanced. You'll find balance in your life, in your love, and this is what's promised to you. If you do the right thing and put this cheating energy to a rest, put it to an end, follow the light of the divine, follow your heart, and, and this is what you're promised.
Very beautiful, Earth signs. But I do feel you're going to have to step up your game. You're really going to have to convince this person that you're for real this time. Because I do feel that they, they've they heard this song and dance before. And they're not going to be fooled if this isn't real. So if you truly love this person and you truly come towards this person, beautiful things um, will happen this weekend. So best of luck to you, Earth signs. Um, follow your heart and you can't go wrong. Have a great weekend. God bless.